Typhoon Hagopi tore apart homes and sent waves crashing through coastal communities across the eastern Philippines on Sunday, creating more misery for millions following a barrage of deadly disasters. The typhoon roared in from the Pacific Ocean and crashed into the remote fishing communities of Samar Island on Saturday night with wind gusts of 210 kilometers an hour. The wind strength made Hagopit the most powerful storm to hit the Philippines this year, exceeding a typhoon in July that killed more than 100 people. We're not that anxious because it has always been like this year. We always get typhoons here, even Haiyan, but it wasn't that destructive. Despite the typhoon's intensity, residents said that they were confident of their safety. Across central Philippines, more than 1.2 million people were crowding in 1,521 evacuation centers as local governments were providing the evacuees basic needs. However, there are worries about sanitation and the impact on health of the evacuees in cramped spaces, especially in urban areas. Local radio said that there were at least two dead from eastern Samar, but officials could not confirm the report. Meanwhile, the greatest concern is that Hagupit's huge diameter of 600 kilometers meant that about 50 million people, or half of the nation's population, were living in vulnerable areas.